Hello, welcome to Dot Hack GU. This is uh, the like fancy new version of all of this that's uh, recently released on PS4. It's got the original three games that were released for uh, like, PS2. Then uh, like a fourth bonus volume, as well as like bonus good stuff and a parody mode. But um, I'm gonna start with a new game. Uh, normal game or cheat? Ow, 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 tie myself up in cables. Cheat mode recommended for those who played it. Um, nah, we'll go normal. I played one of the Dot Hat games back in the day, but I think that was like the original, original game. Can't even remember what it was called. It was the one where Kite is the protag protagonist, main character. I remember really enjoying it. So hopefully this uh, kind of gives me that same kind of enjoyment. Ooh. That's one thing I didn't, well I, I say didn't like. But I thought it would have been cool if they let you create your own character in the um, original dot hack as well. But, um, that's not really a big deal, is it? A sayo. I'm guessing that's us. It's definitely the dude on the front of the box. The world, R2. The Eternal City, Makanu. So, if you have no idea what Dot Hack is, it's um, if you think Sword Art Online, I suppose that's like the modern comparison. Um, if you don't know what that is, basically, it's a like. MMO VR game. At least I think um, that hack was a VR game. Um, this is cool. Oi! Oi! Saucono Maruchu Epon! Hey, you, you, the adept bro. Yeah, you, I'm talking to you. So I take it this is your first time playing the game. Yeah, I just finished installing it. Well, if you wish, we will be honoured to show you around. I'm sure you would like to become well acquainted as soon as possible. Just say yes and come along with us. I promise you won't regret it. Oh. Mm. All right, it's decided then. Here, I'll ha hand you my member's address. Acquired Iotans and Asta's member address. Member addresses are short email addresses that you can only use in the world. Short mail allows you to instantly send and receive messages from any player online in the world. You can only invite people that you have member addresses for to join into your party. Right, so let's open the menu. Yeah. Well, okay. Uh, select party. This is a list of the people we have. Member. Choose our name and press X. Invite. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Done. Okay, great. Now your party is complete. Remember, you can only invite people logged into the world. 
Enough with the formalities, we should get on with your first adventure. Uh -huh. Head to the save shop before going on an adventure. To the save shop, clerk and choose save from the menu. Save progress. Wow, okay. Seem like really speedy. So, um, let's save then. Can we talk to him as well? You can save your game data here. Come here when you reach important points in your adventure. That's pretty easy. After going, uh, after preparations are complete, use the Chaos Gate to go on the adventure. Is it going to be as I remember, where you, um, this uh, transporter is called a Chaos Gate. Players can use this to travel from the root town to other locations. Choose the walk menu. Um, is it going to be like I remember where you had like keywords? And you'd like mix like three or four keywords together to cause a uh, location. In the world, all locations except for root towns, fields and dungeons are called areas. You can walk to these areas by combining oh, three words at the chaos game. Yeah, this is how I remember. These words. Determine the type of area, monster strength, and so on. Let's try word selection. Choose area. Here you input the words. The thing at the top is a word play. Combine three words in here to create the area you want to The gyro at the left shows your current stock of words. Ah, okay, so it looks like at the moment I have very limited vocabulary. <laughs> I know the word courageous. Get more words by getting information from our players, emails and forums. So I kind of have to unlock you know, this. Um, okay, why don't you give it a try? Let's start with the first word. Choose courageous. Select courageous. Uh, monsters in this area are just right for your current level. The items you can acquire will be just right. Engaging. Day Okay, now you can go to your first area. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. See the mark on the left of the world area. That's a server symbol. It indicates the server you're currently in. Right now it's showing Delta. As you can see, we're in the Delta server. If it's a different server, you go to another area, even with the same word. Okay. Pay attention to the service symbol when invited to an area by a friend. If you want to know more, just check out some of the forums. That's right. Um, then we're off to Delta Courageous and engaging Daydream. It's a bit annoying that it's all like Japanese voiced. You kind of have to speak over them. So we've been transported to a field. Open your map and take a look at the layout. Go ahead and click the touchpad. Okay. This is the map area. Mm. Use the screen to check current position, mission info and any other information you may need. First, let's take a look at what our mission is. Go ahead and press X. Uh, this is our mission. Collect a number of simple fragments required for this area. Current possessed none of three. Missions are basically, um, well, I guess they're like our objective for the area. It looks like this is a collection mission. We must collect three simple fragments and make our way to the Beast Temple. The simple fragments are in treasure chests and found on the orders. These are protected by monsters, so our only options are to open the treasure without being seen or defeating the monsters first, then open the treasure. There are the Ultra Icons. First, we head to each of these icons and open the treasure chests. Now, this is the icon for the Beast Temple, which is our final destination. Now that we have confirmed what our mission is, let's be on our way. Well, Pastor, you forgot one more thing. Uh, platform, use this transport to return to town after completing the area's mission. It's also got a healing function called Platform Rest. Which you can use once in the area, use it when you're low on HP and SP. Okay, let's really get going. If you're unsure where the Beast Temple altars are, check. 
Um, it's not that difficult. The mini map. It's pretty nice looking. It's very clear. That's nice. We found an altar already. Are they goblins? Perform a surprise attack by approaching the monsters around the altar. Might be seen and pressing X when the target cursor appears. So, if we go the long way around. Good. I'll press X for a surprise. Wow, you don't even need to get close. That's what I can the battle area spreads out like this. Battle area is surrounded by the battle fence. So it's actually impossible for anyone to escape. The only way to escape is with an arrow. That's why I don't have one right now. So I'll fight it out. Approach an enemy and hit X repeatedly. Easy. Hey, you're not too bad. Not so difficult, huh? Hold on X and release it when the gauge is full. Charge sets are effective even against enemies that are guarding. Bang. Yeah, keep it up. That's it, just continue fighting like that. Regular uh, combos, charge, and then circle guard. I love how much help these guys are doing. Oh wow. Okay, now they're helping. Good work, guys. Got some XP, three gold points, health link, gold points, gold pieces. Sometimes the treasure chest on top of the altars will contain symbol fragments here to open the beast temple. Remember to search the treasure chest after defeating the monsters around the altars. Collecting three symbol fragments by opening the treasure chest on the altars, the symbol fragments used to open the temple gates. Symbol fragment. Acquire the first single fragment and head to the next altar, which is over here. All right, we found another altar. I'll teach you about using skills to attack. Perform a surprise attack by approaching the monsters around the altar without being seen. A blessing X when the cursor appears. Sneak up on them. <laughs> I like how I'm basically. I was going to say, seems to walk by just running very slowly. But, um, no, he does actually go into a walk. Making a combo is just simply Skills and everything do much more damage. Triangle! To do skills. Skill trigger is shortcut for preferring skills. Press R1 to open the tree. Skill menu. Uh, okay. Uh, I can do Gale Blade. Okay, there you see the skill trigger menu. You see the four panels. You can press the button that corresponds to each panel to execute the different arts. Now try out the art by using Gale Blade. Cool. Alright, perfect. Skill trigger is not just a shortcut. It can be used to stop enemy attacks, or it can be used to interrupt one of your own. Aren't you forgetting something important in Yoten? That's an even more important use of the skill trigger. Uh, of course I haven't forgotten. You're talking about Rengeki, right? Rengeki is an advanced skill attack with an increased amount of inflicted damage. Force Rengeki uses a skill attack when an enemy is surrounded by a blue and purple ring. It appears when continuously inflicted damage. Attack the enemy until it is surrounded by blue and purple rings. Get back up. Okay, so Rengeki. Girl Blade. Favourite action is triggered when Rengeki is used or other conditions are met. It raises the morale of your party members and will allow you to execute more powerful attacks. Conditions for favourite action vary from the party members. There you go. Very well. Very well, pay as you wishes. Alright, Hasio, it's up to you now. Trigger gauge will appear above the player's head when a skill trigger is used. It's not possible to use items or skills until this. 
That was pretty cool. And we got a bonus for using the Rengeki. Uh, more gold, more health drinks. Let's get the treasure chest. Uh, acquire the second symbol fragment. Head to the third and final altar. Is it going to be another little tutorial session? Or are they just going to let me get on with it? Oh, this is the final altar. Remember that e what Eoten and Asa have taught you and acquired Acquire it. They're ours. Wow, that was super quick. And I leveled up. Yay! Got another symbol fragment. Uh, the symbol fragments have started to shine and have joined together. Quite an item. Judge's symbol. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Yeah, awesome job. Right, let's finish off by heading for the Beast Temple. Now you smell to check your position just like we told you. So we need to head to the south. I don't know where it is, but for some reason I don't feel like I should be trusting those two. Not be me being all like cynical and stuff, but Maybe it's because I can't see Yoten's eyes. That haircut sort of give me bad guy vibes. Um. Hey, where are you going? Okay, I can't heal up before I uh, run in here. In a door. Opened. Oh wow. That boss. This is a statue of Flosser, the god of law. We just call it the beast statue, but I think in the game story it's supposed to be an important god or something. Cool, wow. You see that treasure box? That's the offering to the beast statue. There's rare items inside that. No, only you can only get one in this area. Go ahead and open it, Hasio. You sure? Go ahead, you're so noob. You need all the help you can get. Ah, oh, cheers. They're always wrong about these two. Sky Gear. Thank. Huh, what the... The items in the church are just are your rewards. Yes. And our reward is you. I love taking out this effect, noobs. It's really quite fun. Face it, an idiot like you isn't qualified to play this game. Hey, hold on. I thought you said I could kill this one. Don't you remember? Wow, what a pair of dicks. This is my reward. Nice one. Oh. 
nice fight there. Perfect. <laughs> no, what do you expect from a new who just logged in from the first time? Come on, say something already. Hello. I swear, just pretend it's. Just pretend to be their friend and they fall all over themselves to let you PK them. Hey, you still around, aren't you? Good. Ah. What the? Oh, wow. <laughs> Karma, hey? The hell is his arm? Wow, that's that's imbalanced. It's like somewhere between Auron from Final Fantasy X and like Hellboy or something. Yeah, that's right. Hold square to revive. Wow. Eight months later. That guy's got it underneath as well. Just to make sure. I understood. <laughs> Please help me. What an idiot, huh? <laughs> the terror of death! It's Hesse, the PKK. So I guess, like for the last 70 months, there's just been going around killing people, the kill other players. It's like some sort of bizarre comic retribution. Wow! That's pretty cool. Oh wow. He's got some pretty cool skills. Wow, he's like using all the weapons. Not like limited from class then, or limited class weapons. Cool. So <laughs> 
I'm surprised I didn't think you'd be that strong. I guess this means all the rumors about you killing 100 PKs wasn't a lie after all. Hey, come on, don't look at me like that. Here, let me apologize. So just take it easy. Calm down and die. <laughs> No. I think that's what she needs to do really, isn't it? Do you know Tri Edge? What did you say? It's a legendary PK, shrouded in blue fire. They say players that get killed by him never come back to the game. Oh, uh, come on now, don't tell me you actually believe that crap. Those old forum fairy tales. So you think you can go up against a great Bordeaux and just walk away like nothing happened? <laughs> yeah, I think I can. And I just did. <laughs> Volume 1 Rebirth It's slightly more dark than I remember the original being. So, it's you. You, the character that stinks of death. The terror of death. The PKK. Hasia. Players who kill other players are disgraceful. And I agree with several how PKs can just strut around the world so easy these days. Why is it right that you, PKKs, have chosen to use brute force to stop them? I don't have time for this, not now. You have no authority and it earns you nothing, so why? I'm the leader of the Moon Trees Unit too. My friends call me Sakai. I'm afraid I cannot overlook your actions. Did you say Moon Tree? What's that, the name of a guild? Sorry, it's okay. But I've already got enough friends, thanks. You always interrupt people like that. No, Sakaki wasn't finished talking to you yet. Atoli, do you know this person? Atoli? It's not usual to meet players with similar characters in an online game like this. Just in case of mistaken identity. Hey, you. Why don't you just. Huh? A text message? Delta server. There are hidden forbidden waterfall waiting at Ark Clone Cold? But who sent it? Ovan? <coughs> Just hold on a moment. Why don't you stop acting like a complete fool? Remember what you PKKs are trying to do. If you succeed, you'll be no different from the PKs themselves. This must be the waterfall.
Over. It's been a long time, Hasio. Or may I should call you the terror of death. You've gone quite strong. You looked stronger than you were back then. Well, I was forced to become stronger, thanks to you. Where have you been? Always a reliable one. I knew I could have you. When the Twilight Brigade broke up, why didn't you come then? What have you been doing the last six months? I was busy. It was such a small seed. You need to find out what was growing inside. And there was only one way to find out. That's why I decided to raise it. You raised it? What are you talking about, Ovan? I'm speaking figuratively. When you disappeared, we all just... Why did you disappear like that? After that, Shino. That's it. Do you want to know about the Triage? Wait, you know Triage? Six months now. And Shino hasn't come back to the world since Triage killed her. Meanwhile, the real life Shino is laying in a coma, and no one seems to know the reason why. Triage is not a normal PK. So you knew about Shino? Yes, well that's all I know. Are you able, if you were able to find Triad, you might learn something about Shino's coma. We also learn more about what really happened that day. And if you were somehow able to defeat Triad, then maybe Shino would come out of the coma. If my information is correct, he will be back today. At the scene of the crime. Scene of the crime? You mean... Hidden Forbidden Holy Ground. The place where Shino was killed. The Hall Grand's Cathedral. Yes. I, finally. I'll get my chance. I swear I'll bring Shino back. I'll do it over now. Yes, you and I. We're the only ones who could possibly bring her back. We're the only ones. I'll meet you at the Holy Ground. Yes, I know must do. This must be the holy ground. I like his armor. Apart from the front. I don't see why it's like so exposed. Triage is coming here. They say there used to be a statue of a girl here. A girl? Th that's right, she was called Aura. I wonder why she disappeared. Who knows? Maybe she just lost her interest. Lost hope for this world. What's that sound? Behind you! Kaiba. 
hype. Is that fire? No problem. Damn. Damn. What the hell? What the hell are you? This guy killed Chino. It's not over yet. He's basic. Yeah, that is cut. Them fighting with evil and stuff. Apart from it is being like deconstructed. Reboot complete. Order. Order. What the... Try edge to oh, I was trying to try edge, but then... Damn it, I can't remember. System reformatting complete. I don't remember doing that. Reformatted? What's going on? What about my emails? Reformatted? What's going on? What about my emails? Fine. No mail data found. Huh? What the hell? I would never delete these. They're all gone. Even the emails I got from Shino. No addresses. No mail data. No greeting cards. Everything's been reformatted. What the hell is going on? You have one new email. Do Choices. There are two paths before you. One of these will lead to safety and shame. There's a path where you give up. The world and never log in again. The other path leads to peril and pride. It's a path where you continue the world and resume your search for the truth. Let me be blunt. The later path is tortuous and will threaten both your mind and body. Once you've chosen it, there will be no turning back. And if you still choose to walk this path, then there will come a time when you and I will meet once again in the world. When this time comes, 
I will say this. I will once again say this to you. Welcome to the world. Tron truth. Whether or not I should quit the world, you should know better over. I'm gonna go back to world. Then I'm gonna get Shino back no matter what. I would quite like to save it as well. Hey. Saving it. Yay. I'm going to um finish this now before we get further into it. Um, but let's have a quick look at what's on the menu. News capture. Oh, okay. Free streaming. Welcome to the to Online Jack, the no holds barred information program. It brings you the hottest topics. Okay. So that's kind of like stuff going on. Sort of like all like the sort of background to it all going on. It's pretty cool. World news stuff. Death by gaming. Oh no. Uh, national news, world news. That's that's kind of cool. Uh, community forums. So forums for the world, Crimson Verse, App Kalu. No idea. Crimson Verse. Not in service currently. And movie player. Which is, looks like unlockables. It's kind of cool. Yeah, so, um, yeah. I'll um, probably play some more of this later. Because, um, it's kind of cool. Definitely giving me some nostalgia. Yeah. But yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.